Hey guys, Steve here again. Uh, today is Sunday, September 7, 2014. Uh, this is the second installment of for today's um, video. Um, I actually had some um, um, enough stuff to break up the video into my Hot Wheels versus non-Hot Wheels. Uh, so make sure you check out my Hot Wheels finds as well. Um, here are the non-Hot Wheels stuff that I have to share with you. Again, most of the stuff is either through trade or finds. Um, Starting with this particular piece, I actually traded this with um, um, one of the club members, uh, Bill. Um, these, this is the Auto World True LE car. Um, there's actually several of these. Uh, I have um, a white one, a black one, and a black one. Um, these actually started appearing in at um, TJ Maxx's, uh, Marshalls, and um, I think Ross Dress for Less. Um, the significance with this piece is the, the white and black ones are actually limited to 5,000 pieces. Um, this one's actually limited to 1,500 pieces. Um, now my understanding through another collector online is that this piece, piece was only available as a mail-in offer. Um, so I'm not sure why they ended up, started ending up in the, you know, secondary market in, um, in, in you know TJ Maxx and, and th those types of stores but either way it's fine with me um, pretty cool piece this is the red uh, Dodge Challenger wide body uh, TR True LE uh, exclusive um, from Auto World okay very detailed um, nice pieces the problem with these pieces though when these originally came out was they were really priced way I think a lot of people will think uh, these were really priced um, pretty high. Um, if I'm not mistaken, um, the only place that I, I was able to find these particular cars in in my area was at Toys R Us, and they retailed in the neighborhood of twenty to twenty-two dollars. Um, when they showed at TJ Maxx, they were retailing for like five ninety-nine or something like that. So much more realistic, and that's probably why they ended up in these stores is because nobody was buying them, All right? The other, the other Auto World I wanted to share with you is also um, a trade as well. I traded a green light, um, um, green machine vehicle. Um, this is the um, Auto World 1965 Ford GT40. It is an ultra red, so it's the chase piece. Very nice piece, the car and driver um, release, which is considered from, from Auto World's point of view, um, their premium line, um, the premium license line. Um, so nice piece. The next uh, five pieces um, I got from James uh, from the club. This is the Series One. Um, actually, excuse me, is a mix of Series One and Series Two um, green light black bandits. We'll start with the Series One start pieces I have here. Um, this particular piece is uh, these are all black bandits. This is a 1964 Plymouth Fury convertible. Pretty cool. Um, from Series 1, uh, limited to 4,032, and this one is number, probably one of the lower ones I have. Um, this one's number 45, so low number, that one. Uh, another Series 1, um, the 68 Chevy Chevelle SS. Uh, number, actually, this is even lower, number 8. And then the last of the Series 1 is a custom 69 Ford Mustang Boss 302. Very nice piece um, with the flames. Number 3,480, so a little bit higher. And if you kind of tell from, it's hard to show in the video, but there's some, some um, the car is of course gloss black, but um, the flames are actually in a, in a flat black to make them stand out a little bit more. And then I have two Series 2 cars. We have a 2007 Shelby uh, GT500, uh, also limited to 4,032 pieces for this series. Uh, this is number 1,444. And then the last Series 2 piece I have here is a 71 Chevy Camaro Z28. Uh, similar to the other one I showed you, this one is actually, of course, gloss black, but the flame, at least the outline of the flame, is a flat black. A nice piece, I like the rims on this. Um, and this one is numbered 3,216. Okay. 
All right, moving on, uh, let's go to Matchbox real quick. Um, just want to share these two mainline pieces. Um, these two pieces are um, of the latest and greatest Matchbox case um, I found at Walmart. Um, the top is an International Workstar brush fire truck. Pretty nice piece. And the bottom is a Ford Police Interceptor um, Marshall, dark green. Okay, those will get open. And then, as I've stated in previous video, um, the other Matchbox set that I'm wor currently working on is an older set. It's back from 97. This is the Matchbox Gold 75 Challenge. Um, basically, it's 75 um, cars, specific cars and trucks and other and other vehicles. Um, there's 75 of these, and I'm probably now about a third way through. There's a lot of them. Um, this is car number 20, 1997 Firebird Ram Air. I'm working on a loose set, actually. We have uh, number 22, Lamborghini Diablo. Uh, number 35, uh, nice one here. Uh, number 35, uh, Mercedes GTC. And finally, a number 62, the Street Streak. This is a fantasy car, kind of looks like a Pontiac. I'm working on the loose set of this, so, so those will get um, open. And the last thing I have to share with you are, are some M2s. Um, this is also a new release. This is the um, 1974 Mustang Boss 429. It's the green, it says green, not yellow, green um, gold chase of this car. Limited to 3,000 pieces. Um, this I actually got through a trade. Thanks, Ken. And then finally, um, I got a couple of these. Um, also, um, a gold chase. This is the um, the new, uh, latest and greatest uh, auto hauler from M2 Machines. It's a 57 Dodge COE with a 71 Dodge Charger RT Hemi. Okay. And I have two of these. One of them I found myself, and one of them I got through a trade. Again, Gold Chase. Very nice piece. Okay. Right. So, there you go. Okay. Alright, so um, that's all my not Hot Wheel stuff. I hope you enjoyed it. Very quick one here. Um, until then, we'll talk to you guys later. I am waiting for... Um, I'm getting ready to um, um, place an order for. To, uh, I bought a pur I purchased a whole bunch of cars from a friend of mine online, Donnie. And once I get those, I'll share those with you. That's going to be a little bit of a mix of uh, Matchbox as well as Hot Wheels, some older stuff, um, so I think some garage stuff. So I'm looking forward to um, sharing that with you guys. Um, so until then, have a good one, happy hunting, and we'll talk to you guys later. Uh, don't forget, K Day this this thir uh, this fr uh, Saturday, September thirteenth. Uh, make sure you get out there. Q case, final case of two thousand fourteen. Um, obviously, the anticipated Datsun five ten wagon is the last super of two thousand fourteen, and the last regular treasure hunt is the cloak and dagger, the green uh, vehicle. Okay, all right. Talk to you later. Have a good one. Bye.